Hey guys, now on the next couple of videos coming up, or I might actually just put them all in one pair to see, it's about small time or small town cops. Now, Paula Gray is a lady that originally had her kids taken off of her for five months without any reasonable grounds whatsoever. And the day before court proceedings, the police literally dumped them, or I'm not sure if it was actually the police or social welfare, WinSIPS, OT, whatever scumbag organization you want to call themselves this week. Um, they just dumped, the, dumped her kids on the doorsteps. Now, the first clip is going to show Hunter and the trauma that she suffers now from even seeing police. Hunter's just told me that the police are here again. She's freaking out. Come out with me this time. They need to see what they do to you. Come out with me this time, you kids. They need to see what they do by doing this. Because I've just asked this chap not to come. They're not here to take you, baby. They're not here to take you. Are you the chap that I just asked not to come? Excuse me, can you see what you've done to my daughter by two? I asked you not to come, sir. What's your name? Excuse me, sir, what's your name? Excuse me, sir, what's your name? Excuse me, sir, what's your name? I asked you not to come to my address because two sergeants came yesterday. Can you not and record you, me, please? I will record you. No, you can't. You can't record me. You have no right to record me. Well, Can you not and you, me, please? I will record you. No, you can't. You can't record me. You have no right to record me. Well, Can you not and you, me, please? I will record you. No, you can't. You can't record me. You have no right to record me. What's your name, sir? I've already spoken to you on the phone. And Can I please have your badge number? I've already given you my badge number. Okay, so your name is Bryce and you're a 1084 and you rang me. I asked you not to come here and you've come here. Excuse me, sir. You can't... I'd like you... You need to move away from my car. Excuse please. me, can you please call a sergeant? Can you move away stop, from Stop, please? please. Can you please stop and call a sergeant? I asked you not to come here and you have. No, you've made my children hysterical by directly coming here when I asked you not to. You were driving here. I asked you not to come because you got an incomplete report and you've driven here and parked outside my house. Sir, this is called intimidation. Could you please call your Sergeant Bryce? Excuse me, sir, can you not leave the scene? I don't want you to leave the scene. Excuse me, sir. Paula herself, her, her um, hunter's mother, has um, been clinically diagnosed with a police phobia, or phobias, mainly to do with police. So what do the police too do in Harware, or, or where she lives, in small little district towns? What do the police do instead of sending people stuff in the mail? No, they call round there in person, adding to phobias and anxiety and stress. What's happened with Paula in the last year is absolutely disgusting. Um, they, the police won't even get crisis. Crisis teams now refuse to assist. You've got chemists dishing out six amounts of 60 clomazepam, diazepam in one go to this woman. Uh, you've got to wonder, are they trying to give her the ability to fucking top herself? Not that she would, she's not that way inclined, but I mean, oh my God, and these are prescribed for her to deal with the phobias and the anxiety that's caused by the police doing what they're doing. And 
initially, back on the 5th of November last year, um, a friend of Paula's called her because she thought she was going to get arrested and she wanted Paula to, to document it. LKW 988. Can I have your number and name, please, sir? Can I please have your identification, sir? It's on there. Your name, sir? It's on there. I 997. Your name, please, sir? Who's here? What was your name, love? Santina, so you're under arrest. Santina. For what? Okay. She's not trespassing. This is, she owns this place. Who says? No, you don't. I was there. Nobody went on that property. No, she didn't. Don't put your dirty gloves on, Caleb. You are so violent. Point, please, please don't you hurt that woman, Caleb. I'm going to put this right where you know where it'll go. What's Thank your last you, name? That. I'm not going to tell you my last name, Paula, but I am going to arrest you. For come here, you guys. Come by your nan. Come by your nan. If you don't get out of the way, I'm going to Come by you your nan, you can some help here because I've got police people harassing the shit out of me, man. Oh, you can, you're, up, you're in the rest. Why? 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 What for? I'm just doing anything.
You're a, you're in Doris. Why? 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 She didn't do anything. She did nothing wrong. Take my phone, Benny. Get my phone behind me, Benny. Stop it. She's got no, sore hands. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Film it. Patricia, help me. The other cops are. Um, she's not going to fight you. I don't know why. I'm not two men. E eight six one. And the other one is one nine. Because she's. Old woman. Do you like hurting old woman? Don't let me go. Hey, hey, no, this is three inches today. I can put at least two fingers in me. And now they're arresting 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 me. And now they're ar
No, Patricia had it. What? Otherwise, use the car loader. I can't get a rest to this fucking kid. I can't get a Look, they got a rapist cop out the front here. He's not dressed up in his monkey suit, but he'd be allowed to get in the car. This is my fucking favourite cop. Oh, you know, we never run that guy ever. He told me he was no case. Matt Stevens involved me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no, no case, they can't. Should have fucking tested his friend up all the time. And then he told me why didn't I go to the police because the towers are fucking paid and fucked. Yeah, yeah. Still, that's an assault. Yeah, yeah. Using your vehicle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah
more friendly the you less amount of time I spend alone with you, the better. You are speeding, sir. You are putting people in danger. What a drama queen. You are really are a homosexual. Someone told me you were a drag queen, but I think you're just a drama queen. Thank you. 
Attempted to rape by putting your finger in my vagina as you put me in the car. But this guy claims she headbutted him. He's taken a fucking 10 minute video of himself with no injuries to his forehead, with no injuries whatsoever, and if he was headbutt, oh gosh, wouldn't you be somewhat disorientated? You certainly wouldn't be driving a cop car 150 mile an hour, 150k an hour, with lights and sirens on, with a with a, an arrested person in the back that's just made claims of sexual assault against you. I'm disgusted by this. There's other cops there. Kylie Brophy. He's got some issue that he thinks... <laughs> Again, they show up at her house a lot. So he shows up and Paula being proactive likes to record all the interactions. And she recorded him going back into his cop car. Telling him to just leave them alone. You're causing my, my family upset continually. There's no reason why you couldn't have posted whatever it was you brought around. But no. And she goes up and films me and goes, You can't film me. You don't and you. I will record you. No, you can't. You can't record me. You have no right to record me. It is perfectly lawful and legal to record a police officer in the fucking execution of his duties. Hi. How are you, mate? Yeah, brilliant. Who are you? What's your name? My name is Acting Senior Sergeant Scott Dixon from the County's Manicure District Headquarters. Oh, yeah. AI 19? Yeah, Sierra Delta, Alpha India 19. Brilliant, Alpha Numerics, love them. Yep. Yeah. So, am I free to go yet? Because I've been yeah. unlawfully detained for yes, about 20 minutes now. I've, I never detained you. No, well, she has, so. Yeah. so am, I just, acting... am I still being no, detained? No, or? it was just until I could find out what I was meant to be doing. Still, I was still by detained else. for no reason, though, for illegal and lawful activity. So, well, I but can say I'm, you've I'm not done anything I'm, wrong. Fair I enough. said you'd done fair anything enough. wrong. I just said I had to wait to find out from my supervisor who sent me down here. Fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Chain of command and all that. Yeah. She did well to catch up with me, and too. It's not me, it. and I didn't send her down here. That's all so, right. No, it was Dave. I, I know that. Yep. I heard her talking to him, yeah, so it's all good. Yep. 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 So, Dave's a bit of a panic merchant. That's all right. Our concern. As in, you're, you're, you're entirely correct, and you are free to go, so you don't have to stand here and listen to me. I don't mind you. listening. Um, is it's all good for the channel. Yeah, you're in a public place, yeah. and you're quite entitled to take photographs of anything while in your public place, just like we are as well. Perhaps they were picked on or bullied at school. That's why they do what they do these days. That's just my opinion. But perhaps these people need to start getting held accountable. I'm going to be filing an IPCA against young Mr. Turfrey because... One, I've got footage of him swiping a 14-year-old after, just, sorry, 
he's recording the 14 year old he comes up he smacks the phone out of this young ch young kid's hands and then pepper sprays him Caleb too free don't like being filmed no that kid's doing nothing he's 14 this kid just filming Caleb Turfrey of the Harwera Police Station. This is the same idiot that was driving one-handed while filming himself with the fucking arrested person in the back seat. This has gone on for over a year now. The initial charge has been dropped. The bail conditions still exist for that charge, even though the charge is no longer before the court. And all of the other subsequent charges have been added on due to the anxiety and stress that they keep causing and the reactions they get from it. They need to stop harassing her. They are going to be getting a notice to cease and desist. Any further alarm, distress and harassment they are causing this mother. How dare they? Small town politics needs to stop. You all are applicable to the Police Regulations Act 2008 and you'd better pull your heads in, officers, and you're all going to be put up on YouTube and this link with the video footage is going to be sent to the IPCA. Perhaps if IPCA actually made it available for me to be able to upload this footage to them, I wouldn't have to put it up on a website to then send the link. But anyway, that's just what I do. But I tell you now, back the fuck off of her. Because all you're doing is causing an innocent woman, and yes, she's presumed innocent, an innocent woman further alarm and distress. Knock it fucking off. To everyone else, I hope you're having an awesome day. And I'll catch up with you later. Bye now.